I learned about Aurora because our pastor was a young uh, recent grad from Aurora. He and his wife, Earl and Miriam Krauss. In fact, he's the one who baptized me. And uh, so when it came time to go to college, I had family that really wanted me to go to Washington State because I had an uncle who taught ROTC there and an uncle who had graduated from there, so they thought it was the only place I should go. But I really wanted to go to Aurora, and uh, probably one of the reasons was there was the ability to work at that time, and I did have to work to pay for my education. When we first got to Aurora, got in our first class meeting, and I looked around, and one of my former grade school students was in my class. His father was our pastor in Sumas, and they, when we were in the sixth grade, I believe it was, he moved to California. Frank Robinson was one of our classmates, and I was so surprised to see him. We knew one another, and, and I think that's the way Aurora was. For, you know, when I was there, I would say 90% of the students that lived in the dorms were from Advent Christian homes or, or churches, you know. So um, we had that type of a bond together. I think there was a real sense of family because the denomination was fairly small. And uh, so you knew many people. I think it really deepened my faith by just the way you treat students, you respect them. Um, from the staff at Aurora that uh, you were an important person, you weren't a number. And I think that's one of the things that really attracted me to Aurora was that it was small. And I had heard, I never saw, in, but in the state schools, you were a number. And uh, I think the individuality, just being an individual and uh, getting, to know the, to prefer, getting to know the professors and all the way down from Dr. Stevens down, you know, you got to know them. I know that the 100th anniversary is coming up I would like to see it become maybe more prominent in the Advent Christian churches, the knowledge of it, so that that we will be more aware of of the college of its of its um, faith based education because that is something that is needed so badly today.